One week ago, the Switch version 19.0.0 came out and your Switch was bricked because you hadn't the Atmosphere version installed, which is actually supporting the newest version because it was new. Well, today I will show you how you can install the newest homebrew version on your Nintendo Switch that supports 19.0.0 because Michael, which is the programmer of Atmosphere, was very, very quick and very fast in doing so. First, what you need to do is to download the homebrew pack 19.0.0 and you can find that actually here on Telegram. If, it, if you're joining our Telegram and it looks like this here, then you just need to go into the pinned message Click on this one here and you will come inside the text uh, server or group, whatever you want to call it. And then you will just need to download here inside the homebrew packs, the 19.0.0 pack switch. And patrons, as always, you will find everything also here inside the Discord server. Once you have it downloaded, you will find here the zip file. You want to open that up and you will find here a folder inside. You want to get that out of here so that it is actually here on the desktop or wherever you want to have it. Now, as you can see here inside, you will have Atmosphere Hacker Day 6 and also like security so that your switch is definitely secured to not get banned or anything like this. Now, what you want to do is to connect your micro SD card with your computer. What I'm going to do is to do it over Hecate. Yes, the older version of Hecate still works. I saw some people talking about, oh, the new Hecate version is out, but it doesn't give you like anything it didn't before. So what you want to do, uh, what I want to do is right now to uh, cl click here on SD card so that I can connect my micro SD card of your switch to my computer while it is connected here with the cable. So I will have it right now, right here. And what you want to do, even, even if it is empty right now here inside, it doesn't matter. You don't need to have like all of those stuff here inside, which I have. You just want to copy paste everything here into your micro SD card. As you can see, switch SD and this here is the package. Just copy paste it here. It will eventually ask me if I want to replace stuff. So I'm going to click yes. Let's replace the files in the destination. Then we want to right click it and eject it so that we can click here on close, close. Then make sure to click here on tools, then here archbit RCM, and then click here on fix archive bit. And this will eventually delete all of the problems which it made like while transferring all those files from your computer to your micro SD card because it can happen that there are like some files that aren't like transferred correct. And this is actually a good tool in order to fix that problem. And then here home, then launch, and then custom firmware emu MMC. And if you see this picture here, then you're good to go to know that you did ins install it the right way. Once you are here inside and you want to update your switch from the version 18.1.0 to 19.0.0 and didn't do it on your own, what you want to do is to go here into the album so that you are in the homebrew menu. You want to search for Daybreak, okay? You want to click on it. You want to click on install. You want to search for firmware 19.0.0. Click OK. Then here continue. Preserve settings. Install FAT32 plus XFAT. Continue. Then click on reboot. Now, uh, once 19.0.0 is installed, we want to repeat that and go to custom firmware assistant and do exactly the same as before in order to have like both versions, the Emu MMC and the assistant updated on the max. If you only have the assistant, then you only need to do this on the assistant and not the Emu MMC. Though I definitely highly recommend to get the Emu MMC also installed. Go on it. Install. Click on firmware 19.0.0, continue, preserve settings, install XFAT plus FAT32, continue and wait until it's loaded and then reboot. Now, after we reboot, we will eventually like have some problems, um, like some errors or bricks, which will still pop up once we want to try to boot into Atmosphere. Most likely there will be one because we had like the theme installed and if you have the themes installed and update your switch, then the theme isn't compatible with the new switch version, which means we need to do some stuff in order to get everything correctly done. And I will show it to you right now. 100% how everything works. All right, so I'm gonna show it to you in, inside the custom firmware Emu MMC. So this picture pops up and then boom, we have here the first program ID problem BD00. What we're going to do is to click the power button if you have like any problems like these. Then we want to go to tools, USB tools and SD card while having our switch connected with the USB cable to our computer. We actually could also alternatively take out that micro SD card and put it anyhow, like uh, however you want to with your computer um, to get like inside the root of your micro SD card. Here we should actually go to atmosphere and then contents. Most likely you will find the problems here inside. And as you can see, we have one, uh, we have zero, one, many, many zeros, BD00, zero, zero, which made the pro problem before. And then we want to delete this one here. And after we did that, what else we want to have is this here. We have zero, one, many, many zeros, 1000. This is hundred percent, the switch theme. And if you have a theme installed, you will hundred percent have a problem. So. So if you have this problem, then just make to make sure to delete it. If you see it already while you want to delete something else, then you can also do this quickly here so that you don't need to come back once again, or hopefully not. So yeah, now we will eject it once again, close, close, home, launch, and retry it out. <clears throat> All right, and once we're here inside, we can actually open that up. We can go quickly here into the system settings. 
As you can see, we have the system version 19.0.0 with atmosphere 1.8.0. Um, to show it to you here, if you go into album, we are actually here inside the homebrew menu while having 19.0.0 on our switch installed. And I hope that is actually everything. Everything else which you have installed before will also work. So I just made sure that you will get like everything inside the package that it works. A little side note is that everything is in a pre-release and I just tested a little bit out before I actually made this video and I just found out that there are like many hidden bugs. Uh, most likely it should actually work for every one of you, but if you have like any error or anything that is very, very unusual, then you will just need to restart your switch into your um, atmosphere version and then you should be actually good to go. Um, I think it will go around one to two weeks until we have actually the full version out of Atmosphere, etc. And then I will definitely once again inform every one of you with a new package, everything updated, etc. I will also make a makeup package very quick, so make sure to subscribe, make sure to like this video if you did, and I hope I'll see you in the next video. My name is you, don't you ever forget to smile. Peace!